What's going on, everybody? Welcome back into Anno 1800. So, we are back here in Las Bernanderas for a moment. Just to show you, I've been kind of playing around off uh, off camera and working on it. I, I'm, I got really tired. I'm just, I'm so sick of everybody saying, why don't you have brick roads in the new world? Okay, fine. Fine. You want brick roads? There's your dang brick roads. <laughs> you got them, okay? I redesigned the city just ever so slightly, and I have added in brick roads, uh, made a nice little park right here, just kind of shuffled a few things around just to just to kind of liven it up some. Just, just a touch of changes, not a whole lot. Uh, it looks like I've still got a blank spot right here, actually, for something. Um, I am a fan of using this right here. Competitors I'm just kind are of a fan of that. War. Actually, you know what? I have an idea. Let's do something fun. An explosion in one of your factories. Oh, shocking. Ceasefire has Hold on. Ended. Let's go fix that real quick because I don't want to run out of gas. Okay. What? Here it is. Ah, I did it. I used the numpad. So the person is always saying, you need to try the numpad to switch regions. There, I did it. You happy? You good now? <laughs> I did it. I used the numpad to switch regions. That was actually a lot easier. I might have to start doing that more often. Anyways, yeah, there we go. Something kind of just a little different. Gotta, sh gotta shake it up sometimes with some something weird like that. Anyways, yeah, brick roads everywhere. Just did a little slight redesign on a few buildings just to just to kind of make it look a little bit different on occasion. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it now. I reckon I could make you cry like... But that is all we're going to do over here for today. I just kind of wanted to show you what I did right here. Uh, an idea I had, and I talked about it in Discord, and basically the reaction was what I expected was, you, you're crazy. Uh, that is, I kind of want to move this whole city. Like... I kind of want to move the whole city right here i love i love this particular island design i've always liked this island design because it has the two bays and this narrow strip of land with the two uh harbor areas it you can make some really cool looking cities right here um so yeah as crazy as it sounds I might be doing a live stream soon where we literally relocate the entire New World Colony over here. Um, it won't be easy, it won't be fun, but I might just do it. I don't know yet. I still got to think about it because that's that's a lot of work. So yeah, well, uh, what's everybody doing around here? Oh, y'all are waiting. Okay. And then he was dropping something off. You can go back to Cape Trelawney. Okay. Anyways, out of the new world today, we're going back to Cape Trelawney. And today I would like to work on a couple of monuments here. We have two monuments that are part of mods. We have the courthouse, or it's actually called the embassy. That is part of the AI shipyard mod that I want to put in somewhere. And we have the Town Hall Monument, which is what it sounds like. It is a town hall, but it's People just a monument. I would religion. like to put these in somewhere here in the city. Um, so we're going to consider where I might put those. I'm thinking about doing the, t the uh, courthouse, or the embassy rather, right, uh, right around in here. Where this museum is at, because I don't really like the placement of that museum. Um... I thought about doing that, and then also thought about doing, like, a... Fine. We've got some rescue missions come up here, so let's, uh, we'll work on that here in just a second. I thought about doing, like, a little government area, you know, with the courthouse and the town hall, and then create, like, a nice plaza and stuff around it. So, let... I, 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 I've really been kind of staring at this spot right here to do that. I believe the town hall will, yeah, it will fit perfectly right in there. And then the courthouse will fit not perfectly right there. But if I go, s but if I bring it over to here, clear this out and make this a big plaza right here. 
it could do it right there and it would work. I don't want to do it near the palace. Um, I don't want to do it right there. Actually, I could do it right here where we have this zoo at. Because, I mean, this zoo is this zoo is totally movable. Let's see how it works right here. Okay, it does not fit right there, though. It fits this way. But not... Wait, does it fit that way? It does fit this way. The town hall does. And then I could do the courthouse, like, maybe off to the side over here. Or maybe, like, right down here in front of it. Be an interesting layout for it right there. Hmm. Huh. All right, hold on. I'm gonna pause the video while I ponder, and I will come back when I have made a decision. Okay, finally figured out what to do with them. So they're gonna go right here, near this. I'm going to kind of call this the old town right here. I know technically Cape Trelawney, Crown Falls was, you know, we just founded it as the capital. But this is, we're going to kind of call this the old town over here. Maybe, maybe we didn't start building this first. Maybe, you know, this was the original part of the town. I don't know. But this is where, this is a little government district right here. We're going to have the town hall and we're going to have the embassy slash courthouse right here we've got a nice little plaza square with some nice little topiary gardens and stuff out front i think this will be a nice little spot for the center of government now disregard the weirdness going on over here with roads uh, and this weirdness i am working on something something that is extraordinarily tedious to deal with and it's going to take a while but i've got something i'm doing with all these weird roads and all this weird stuff so, what I would like to do first is let's get this guy going. It's going to take 500 artisans to get started, 300,000. Yeah, it's quite the expensive creature. All right, so to get it started, we're gonna need 500 artisans. It's gonna take a half hour, 300 cement and 150 timber. Let's get started on it. And he is going to go all the way up there. So let's give him a warehouse that's a little bit closer. And let's also go ahead and get started on this. It's going to start with 500 farmers. Phase one of three. Again, pretty easy. Only 10 minutes. Let's get that started as well. And we'll get both of those being built. Oh, it looks like that one actually uses a different base color. So let's fix that real quick. Uh, do I want to do that? I don't want too many random fountains everywhere. Eh, you know what? Screw it. Fountains. Okay, there we go. Okay, there. Now it all matches. Yeah, random rows. I got. I'm. Gonna, I've got stuff I'm working on with those. So yeah, these will get all of our little special monuments built right here. I'm excited to see the town hall. The town hall is actually really cool. It looks like it's a little. Well, no. Phase one is the foundation, so we're on phase two, and then there's there's only three phases on this guy, just like it is for these. Cool. I love big, fun monuments. That's going to really add to our skyline right there. It's going to look really good. Well, while those are being built and constructed, let's do a little more work. We got. I want to go ahead and get the rest of our farms right here moved off. And go ahead and free up the, the last bit of farmland from over here. How many do we have that needs to go? That's not what I'm looking for. This is what I'm looking for. We have nine. We have nine grain farms over here. Uh, these are all fine. This is all fine. Yeah. Okay, so nine grain farms. I would like to, uh, I'd like to kind of make them 
snake their way over through here. Let's maybe add in some fun little roads around here. Okay. Let's get started, shall we? And what's fun is I can actually do this and put them other places. Maybe a little one there. Maybe a little one right here. Okay, come on. I can put in like some some houses or something here. Then we can sneak another one in right here. Maybe leave it off of the road a little bit so we can put some trees next to it. Now question. Oh yeah, I'd, so he's going to be in range of Faris al Sarami. That'll be good. This had a production, being a production of what was that? Needed eight, so we need at least nine down here. Okay. And we can move some of this stuff, like, just off somewhere. It doesn't have to be right there. That gives me four. Let's see. This is going to be mostly city up in here. So let's go over here with it. Just got to make sure he's going to be in range of warehouse I'm gonna put a warehouse over here for use by everybody I want to get a little a couple of little farmhouses scattered around I had not done that yet and I really like putting these random little farm homes out here just kind of makes it look like you know the, these areas belong to people you know this is maybe this is their these these are their farms and their homes and stuff. A little, little collection of people live right there. A farm? We know for you. Yes, 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 I'm working on it. Wait, was that a perfect square? Oh, it almost was. It was off by one. Almost had a perfect square. Oh, would have been awesome if I did. Okay, we'll bring him way down there. We're gonna do him like this, I think. Yeah. So we can put some trees in between it. What's that getting me to? Six. Yeah, we could do one right here. It wouldn't hurt. Actually, I want to crank him over a little bit. Okay. Let's keep him off of our power plant. Go there with him. That is, that, that's industrial right there. <laughs> Farm right next to the uh, power plant. Yeah, you know what? I don't actually like that. That just Production doesn't, has stopped. doesn't seem right to me. So we just got a production has stopped notification. Why is that? Yes, just waiting for materials. Yeah, just waiting on materials. How's this one going? This one's going to take a while. Okay.
Yeah, I want to leave some of that area right there kind of good and free and clear. So let's move some of these over to here. Hospital will get moved. Let's move him to right here for right now. All right, that gives me nine. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of all of those. All right. Shouldn't have any left. We don't. And all of these, we got one, two, three... It says I have, oh, I have four. I was looking at the wrong thing. I was looking at bakeries. Yeah, so here's all four of these right here. We'll move all of the flour mills down here with all of these. And I do love having these right on top of each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm busy. Get one of those right there. Let's, let's get one right there next to that little field. And we'll have one more. Um, I really like them next to these fields and stuff. Let's make a little room right here. Get one right in there. Here's something even you can handle. Uh, what have you got for me? Uh, yeah, Strange. I'm gonna ignore that. I don't really need it. I don't need the rep with him. We're all good. Let me give her Hi. some money. Give her a little money. Reason, she didn't want any money. Okay. Fine by me. And you cannot reach the warehouse can right there so we'll put the warehouse next to the market that'll work you also cannot reach so we'll put one over here for you there we go everybody's happy now plenty of plenty of coverage Actually, let's just put that over this guy over here i would love an actual barn i would like a barn I have a list of things I really want. I really need to learn how to mod, and then I could do all of this by, my, by myself and not have to, like, pray that a modder comes along and does what I want. Or not does what I want, I don't mean it that way. Creates the mod that I'm looking for, or the building that I'm looking for. Um, I mean, the modders out there create some amazing work. There's certain items that I think would look really cool in my cities that I don't have the capacity to create, and I would like to see them. What do you mean? say there's nowhere to take it. <sighs> of course. Of course. The people celebrate your leadership. Um Okay, let's just Let's just do this then. You come right here, you come right there, you go there, there, fixed, happy now, voila, everybody should be in range of stuff now, yes they are, lovely, all of those have been moved, this bakery can be moved down with some of the others, um, where would be a good spot for you? Hmm. Where would it be a good spot for him? Done. Oh, first phase is complete. Well, let's go check it out. Okay. Finish that first phase. Look at it. Oh, it's going to look so cool. I just can't tell which side is the front. 
Okay, for the next side, we need 500 workers. 300, 200, and 240. Let's start that phase. It's going to take 20 minutes. How are you doing? You're, you're going to be really slow to build. Okay. Actually, you know what? That might be a... Uh... Oh, no, no, no. A good screenshot would be if we get this phase right here done in this episode. That would be a, a good screenshot right there. I don't know if we will or not, but that would be a good screenshot. Okay, so all of that has been moved down. That is, that's good. That's where I wanted it. We can come up here and do a little uh, cleanup of all of this mess. We don't need any of this. We don't need that. Gosh, we don't really need any of this anymore, do we? Actually, that was powering this stuff up here. So that we do want to keep. I do want to keep that. Let's move that to there. Let's move this one over to here. We'll upgrade him. Okay, so I'm going to take out this. This extra road... What are you? You're iron. Okay, we have a lumberjack's hut that could be moved. Get him out of the way. He can go. He can go. He can go. All oh, this can go. Good deal. All right, there we go. Now that's all cleaned up. Um, might as well go ahead and make some brick rows to those, just so those little cars can go a little, little bit faster. Okay. Your city has grown that reminds me, how is our gas supply doing? Gas is going down. I don't know if we've got a shipment yet or not. I'm going to keep an eye on our gas supplies. Awaiting new horizons. Yeah, here comes gas right there, so we should be okay there. All right, that is all cleaned up, so now comes we need to be able to transport that flower up there. This ship right here... Production has stopped. Hmm. He's taking pigs. Where is he? Is that he him? Holders. Yeah, that's him. Okay, we're going to tell you to take your leadership. that. There we go. Oh, we're going to tell him to load the, all of that up. What, what's going on here? What's everybody hanging around here for? Fleet awaiting get, orders. Get up here. You come over there. There we go. Wait, no... I said the pigs. Oh, he didn't do it right. Dang it. Okay, hold on. Uh, transfer items. That. Okay. We might have to put another. We might have to put another cargo ship on this particular route, or create a huge freighter, which I'm thinking I'm gonna do. Is make a huge freighter to keep all of this supply right here going. Plenty of pigs, plenty of flour. Uh, that's probably a good idea. Let's go ahead and get ourselves a huge freighter built. Probably not a bad idea. From your cold, dead hands. I don't know if I've ever showed y'all this. I did build a motor yes. assembly line over here. It's not on right now just because I have plenty of steam motors in storage for the time being, so I'm not running it. But if I need more, I have a motor assembly line. So we will make another huge freighter, and we will replace the. Aye, aye. We'll replace him, wherever he wherever he went. There he is. And we'll put him on something else. So we had a three-star rescue mission. Here Let's orders. use the invincible for that. Where are my chums? Okay, we have all these ships. There we go. No bitter end in sight. So we need diplomacy and force. Okay, easy, easy enough. 
We'll grab him. We'll grab her for some medicine. Now for everything else I want. I want some hunting. I would like... That's crafting and hunting, crafting and force. Let's get him. He is always nice. There's crafting and medicine. Ah, the time with pitch pulled in hard wind. There's little left to fear once your longboat goes end over end. So, probably need one more thing. Um, actually, let's put him up and let's grab her. Yeah, that'll work. Let's start that rescue mission right there. And let's do... Bye. Let's see, who is this? That is the Adrian. Let's get this, maybe this two-star zoological Six expedition. Cape Trelawney. The, not the Rachel. There you are, the I'll Adrian. Get Hunting, crafting, naval power. Okay, so I want to grab that for the pirates. Remember to check that we here just a moment. Uh, that for the diplomacy. Diplomacy just get the veteran whaler right there for the for that trade union items crafting force crafting and hunting that'll be good so only thing we don't have now is medicine and faith we'll put in brother hilarious and then we'll grab some bread and we'll start that expedition Newspaper time. I've taken to calling you the master. Among share and share alike, rapturous mind. return, and sewing machines. We will cover that Why? up. Anything else? Okay. You gained an influence bonus. So that's those two. Um, how about a botanical expedition? Let's go on one of those. Preparation. All right, Cape Trelawney. Uh, twist of coral. You'll ship, do. Ship. We already got so medicine and crafting. Again, we will toss in one of our captains here. We will throw in. Hmm. Who do we want to throw in? Um. You know what? Let's put in a mobile, a telemobile scope. Let's get an archbishop here. Uh, maybe the grab the doctor. So there's faith, medicine, a little bit of crafting. Uh, let's get maybe a handful more bread. Long to get back to the blue. Medicine, crafting. What am I missing? The thrill of discovering new horizons. Yeah, that'll work. Let's go on. Okay, this so three expeditions going, and we have another visitor. We have another Dr. Salvador. Okay. Ooh, speaking of specialists, check out this one I got in the New World. Production I got an item that I was stopped. so happy about. Uh, here we go. Yeah, we got uh, Garibaldi here. The Chocolatier by Royal Appointment. It affects chocolate factories and plantain kitchens. 50% productivity and produces extra sugar and rum. He is Ready for a challenge. rather lovely rather lovely speaking of chocolate we were running out of chocolate here in you crown falls nurse, i knew they'd get well soon i noticed that we have been running out of chocolate crown falls chocolate 19 all islands 14 so we really could do with could another another chocolate factory down here so let's make that happen. Um, the cherry atop our figure out how to squeeze all cake. this stuff in here somehow. No, <gasps> go away. Okay, so there's another one of those. So sugar and cocoa. Okay, so we do need some more cocoa. We do need a little more sugar. Now, she sells sugar, and it is really, really cheap, actually. And 
some nice cocoa plantations. Yeah, they just produce extra red peppers, potatoes, and grapes. My sugar refiners don't do anything unique. Okay. All right, let's get in another chocolate or another cocoa plantation here. Well, maybe somewhere. I'm just wherever I can put these things, I guess. Uh, there's what is that? What is how much does that actually give me? So I need two more. It looks like. Two more then. Ship constructed. There'd be our huge freighter. Alright, let's bring a road over here so I don't forget. We'll split that in half. Did that give me enough cocoa? That gave me just enough. And I think I'm going to make Let's see. What do I want? You are here to help? I could go and buy the sugar and oh she sells cocoa too. I didn't even notice that. Why how did I not notice that? Um I just want another clipper. I think I just want another clipper. I I've got a clipper there, but I don't want to use that one in particular, actually. Could just do a schooner for this, honestly. Or a brigantine. Uh, yeah, let's just do a brigantine. Yeah, let's do a brigantine. Uh, what do we like in brigantines? We like sails and we like the uh, new orders. The armor piece. So let's grab a couple of those if I have any. Yeah, I've got a sail, and there is a reinforced bulkhead. Let's head down to the new world with that. Okay, there is the viper our new ship so we're going to bring oh, him over right. here and let him hang out and when he oh, gets yeah, up there oh oh yes screenshot time finish phase oh look at it <laughs> hold on that is a screenshot right there. Are you kind or blind? Yeah. Thumbnail. Oh, that thing is cool looking. Oh, that is a beautiful, beautiful piece. I love it to death. Okay. The final phase, 300 filaments, 150 light bulbs, and 300 caoutchouc. Um, 1,000 engineers and a half hour. Okay, we'll start that phase. This phase is almost done as well. Lovely. Oh, and here crying. comes the Salacia. We'll have him trade everything off with the Viper and have the Viper take over that route. New orders. Okay. Uh, a question I've gotten asked several times, and I know I've always commented on it, but just in case you have this is the first time you've noticed it, the huge freighter is is obviously misspelled. Oh my god, how did I never notice that? I need to let the mod author know <laughs> that he misspelled freighter. Has stopped. Uh, the huge freighter is from the modern sail ships mod. Uh, it can be once you have that mod installed, it is built in the Steam Shipyard along with the Red Star Battle Cruiser. There are other ships that are com that come from this artisan shipyard right there advanced shipyard there are some different ones i decided not oh, to yeah, use any of those out of my own like you know i just didn't like some of the other ships from it but yeah that is where the huge freighter comes from let me transfer all this over real quick okay so it's gonna go like that and that and that yes oh wait no. Cargo stations. so we're gonna add the viper i believe let's transfer all these items over to him hold the crane okay not that one this one only i reporting in oh, i already took it off i was like where'd it go there it is 
Okay, we're going to add Cape Trelawney. We're going to add the Viper. So 100, 100, 100 there. Okay. Cargo stations. Sausage, sausage. Uh, soap, soap. Pigs, flour. Okay, good. And that ship is ready to go now. Good. But anyways, the uh, the huge freighter comes at a cost of 850 coins. It does hold 100 cargo per slot. Um, it is a slightly faster. It does have a movement speed of 16.9 compared to the cargo ship, which is 13.7. So it is slightly faster. It does cost about 350 more coins. The only thing about it that I don't know if I agree with totally is the influence cost. Cargo ship costs three. That thing only costs four. I would honestly make it cost um, eight influence. I would double that influence. And I might go in there and do that just for balance sake. Uh, I would have this cost eight influence. That way it is in every way, shape, and form more expensive than the uh, extravaganza steamer. Which is actually far slower than either of those two. But it does make it a lot more expensive. The Extravaganza Steamer cost six. So that's ju that you that's just one little items. thing I would do. I would adjust the uh, price of that thing. Okay, so we're going to come down here Production and we're going to buy cocoa. And we're going to buy sugar. And we're going to drop those off over there. Now, I know I did build a couple of more, but this right here will help to offset the need of it all. Now, we are producing nine. Let's look at all islands, actually. Now we're producing 17 of 19, and I think that is pretty decent. If I up that, oh gosh, that makes them super, super unhappy. Like, super, super unhappy. <laughs> um... Yeah, and I really can't afford to Our make them any more unhappy right now. This. Yeah, I really can't do that. They already have a minus nine for working conditions. What? Uh, oh, the coffee roaster is making them unhappy. You know, I think I'm actually overproducing coffee by quite a bit. Oh, no, we're not. We are just making enough coffee to supply the demand. Okay. What's our chocolate situation? I know we no, we don't have much over there either. I'm kind of looking around and seeing, you know, just what we Our had in terms of chocolate being made. Okay. I think I have a cargo ship that's bringing it. It's all oil. Let's see, where is my chocolate route at? Here it is. Yeah, I have a I have a steamer that's doing chocolate. Okay. I do have this right here, and he does seem to be buying all of the available chocolate. All right, that's what I was curious. He is buying all of the available chocolate from Kahina, so that might be enough. We'll probably have to expand that chocolate uh, production later on again kind of just keep an eye on it there so this thing is about to be done here in a second it looks like oh no it is done finish that phase one more we need copper timber windows 500 artisans and another 20 minutes and as you can see it is called an embassy and not a courthouse but it is rather lovely It's going to be a nice little addition to our city right here. Be a very nice little addition. I like it. Right, where is that huge freighter at? See? God, I've lost him. Where'd he go? Where'd you go, big freighter? How could I lose that thing? How, how do you lose a huge... Oh, did he go over here? I wonder. New orders. No, he didn't go over there. How do you lose it? He's right there. He 
He's right there in front of my face. Okay, yeah, that actually helped a lot. That is going to be good right there. We're happy. We're happy with the huge freighter because that is some uh, very Hi. necessary materials being brought back and forth. So definitely want that on that route. Uh, looks like a couple of our expeditions are ready to be reviewed. What do we got? We're adrift. Blood, oil, sweat, and tears. An overweight ship is easy prey for the stormy waves. Uh, let's release the stern anchor, and we are safe. Okay. And the rescue mission. It's no mere super. Too good to be true. A delicious-looking banquet with no one around to eat it. Uh, let's scan about for danger. Reward discovered. We got either some bananas or some corn. Uh, I'm going to refuse both of those. I don't need bananas or corn. Okay, let's continue on. Okay, that one's going to take a little while. Don't really want to do any more expansion of the city at this second right here. Um kind of good with our current numbers and where we're at. I don't want to go through another uh, disaster of trying to constantly redo everything. Because as you can see, I've got a whole lot of redesign that has to happen right here. I do want to get these put into the city somewhere. We've got a uh, zoo, which actually I might just leave the zoo right here where it's at. Your um, ship has returned from its voyage. Untold perils. Oh, it was him? Okay. Let's bring him right to here. And let's check that botanical Press expedition. What have we got going? A dockyard dupe? We have been robbed. Um, let's try to return to the inn. And we rumble the schemers. Good deal. Let's continue on. So, yeah, he has got... He's got the items on there that I want for that brigantine. You know, I could. He's got some. He's got some room. I could pick up some extra stuff. Coffee is fine. Production has stopped. Anything I could sell? Uh, you know what? Let's just grab all of the potatoes because I don't care about the potatoes. And. Um, red peppers and we'll, we'll sell the red peppers and potatoes how about that that'll do i like that idea all right back to trelawney now yeah i wouldn't mind kind of getting this kind of fixed up a little bit um we don't need that back there anymore maybe i could put this back here somewhere Uh, where, though, is the question? Where? Hmm. Okay, let's do this. We'll do that. We'll go into artisans. We'll grab our grab our plaza streets. We'll connect it up like that. All right. Under our engineers, we'll grab our fences. We'll end the fence right there. Then we'll come up and over. Actually, no, we're not going to end it there. We're going to end it right next to it. That's where I want it. Yeah, we'll end it right here. Okay, now copy this. We went out three from it. Yeah. Okay, so now I just have to re rearrange all of this up in here. Let's get rid of all of these. Let's get rid of all that. Okay. Yep, 
Yes, I know. I'm doing it again. I need to stop doing this design. I got to get away from that design. It is like... It's like I can't help myself sometimes. We could go in the middle right there. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, farmers. Ubisoft stuff. Yeah. Put in a nice big fountain in the middle. It's just like, it's so, it's just so easy to make this design. <laughs> it's so easy. Okay, you know what? I'll do it this way. I'll get away from it this way. Who is that? That's the, that's the walrus. That's the fox right there. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll do this. We'll get away from that design by going over there with it. And we'll bring it up to there. Over to there. To there. To there. Here we go. Ah, not that. Oh god, I hate this. There we go. Okay, and we'll bring him over to there. Bring him down one. Okay. That works. Break up that monotony a little bit. I've got to get away from like the constant square designs I keep making with these things. Okay. Fill all that in. Let's go back under our farmer real quick and go back to our Ubisoft stuff. Put a couple of little fountains in the front. And back to engineers. End it right there. There we go. Okay. Now, let's decorate this up a little bit. Uh, do I have anything I want to put right here? Maybe a, a statue or an arcade? Yeah, I'm not feeling the arcade. Maybe just another another fountain. Kinda like that fountain as a big centerpiece, though. Do I have anything under here that I would want to put in? Actually, yeah, I could do that. The festival has ended. City has grown Actually, up. let's do this. Production has stopped. Let's do that. We'll flip it around. That way, the entrance is kind of over here. We don't need you dragging yeah. us down. And as far as this, whoops, as far as that one goes, if I put it right there. Yeah, that'll work right there. Okay, I like that. Now, right here. Yeah, see that just that got it off now. That's fine. I don't have to put any put anything like that right there. Come and see. Come and see. Just put a little gazebo right there, how about? Now how is this stuff doing? Is this stuff where 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 did I build it again? Uh about halfway done. About the same. Just kinda slowly but surely getting there. Okay, so there's kind of the idea of it. I'll go through and I will uh, decorate it all up here in just a bit. I won't make you all suffer through my tedious decorating right now. Because, as you know, that it could take forever. I will fix that, though. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I'll go through and do a bunch of the decorating stuff later on. Kind of show you what I did. Probably in the next episode. Surround it with a road, though. Okay. That looks lovely. So then we just have another zoo, a botanical garden here, and I think that's the only things we have left that Admiral. I've had to redo. Admiral. All right, let's check that zoological expedition here. 
Unusual debris floats among the waves. Well, we have a veteran whaler. Let's bring him along. What did we find? We find a silver necklace that I don't need. The festival has ended. Send him back on his way. Okay. Yeah, I gotta decide where I'm gonna put the these other two right here, and I and I do want to put more zoos and stuff, which will probably have some zoos and botanical gardens mixed in back in these areas, because um, I'm gonna have like little enclaves of you know estates and stuff, and maybe have some little some little cultural areas with some zoos and museums or something like that kind of stuck in back through there we'll see how it we'll see how that goes i did redo this little zoo right here oh, little zoo this museum right here fix this one right here up a lot i like i love the way this one came out and if you've noticed and i'm sure someone has said but that doesn't look the same yeah i changed up the entire avenue right here i just did not like the white avenue anymore I just, I really got tired of looking the at it. I changed it all leadership. up. This is semi-temporary with the uh, worker block, with just the plain old plazas like that. Uh, until I can figure out exactly how I want to decorate this. But at the same time, I do kind of like it being open like that. It is just a nice, big, wide open, unobstructed boulevard with the hedges down the sides. With some small ornamental trees, and I have the occasional, uh, you know, I have some of these little boxwoods and stuff everywhere, and little parks. I do like the way this looks. I mean, I do have a little statue with a couple of fountains right here. So it, it's not, like, completely barren. You know, I might put something right here, maybe? But I don't really want to fill it all up with random stuff going up and down the middle. I like how wide open it is. It just it just makes the city feel just more open in general and not so clustered with, you know, like this. I mean, this does look good, but it is very uh, cluttered looking to me. It's starting to look cluttered to me with all the trees and stuff. So this right here might get a bit of a uh, this right here might get a bit of a facelift later on. But this is also why I'm redoing this, because I want to change this up a little bit right through here. Uh, and get it all widened out somehow. I don't, I'm not sure how, because this side is already narrower than this side. If I try to narrow it even more, then it'll be even skinnier. It's just... I have created a monster with myself here. I'd have to redo all of this, shift everything over uh, the headaches I get myself into. But yeah, guys, that's all going to be stuff for the future episodes and including these two monuments right here that will be done in the next episode. Get those two out of the way and then we'll get back to doing a little more building. Maybe kind of finish up filling in some of the city right here around the palace and get that filled in. And then hopefully by that point, I'll be ready. It'll be time for me to do a live stream. And in that live stream, we'll probably do a lot of the rearranging I'm talking about doing right now. So that is future plans. Let me know what you're thinking down in the comments down below. And like the video if you did. If you didn't, they dislike it. It's okay too, I understand. Not everything is everybody's cup of tea. But we will see you guys in the next episode. Take care.